In today's video, we have a quick tour over Safari on the iPhone 5S and also on iOS 7. So now let's go ahead and take a look at web browsing on iOS on the iPhone 5S. So if we load up Safari here, now on our home page we have access to our bookmarks. We also do have a return button, a forward button, and if we click this little bookmark here, it brings up our favourites, history, and also any bookmarks that are on there. Now this button here brings up new tabs on there, so we can add or delete tabs. Let's just go ahead and open up a new tab, and let's load up bbc.co.uk. So from here, we have access to tabs that have recently been opened or previously opened. Then we can just flick them across to delete them or click on the certain one to open it back up. Now, when we're browsing on the internet, we do have access to obviously zoom in feature. Now, obviously with the iPhone 5S screen, zooming on the phone is extremely nice and we can see any kind of, and there are no pixels shown at all. All of the text is extremely clear and we do have easy access to it when viewing it. So also new on the iOS is previously there was a search bar and also a web dresser bar, but now we do have access to all in one bar and it does either search or loading up a web page for you, which is just a nice touch by Apple there. Now if we click this button down here, we do have access to either sharing it over iMessage, mail, Twitter or Facebook, and we can also bookmark it, add it to our reading list, add it to a home screen or copy it across. So that's just been a very quick tour over Safari on iOS 7. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit the thumbs up button below, leave any questions below in the comment box and we'll get back to you. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the OneCom YouTube channel for more videos like today. And also take a look at our library and other videos we have. I'm Sam from OneCom and I'll see you all in the next one.